It's a pleasure for me um, to welcome participants, equipment manufacturers, exhibitors, and indeed African and international broadcasters to Africa 2023. This is actually my second official assignment since I, I resumed office on Friday um, as the Director General of the NBC. Um, yesterday I had the privilege of meeting with heads of um, broadcast regulatory agencies from the West African sub-region. Um, Africa's was conceived as a forum for examining the challenges posed to broadcasting by the multifaceted social economic, political, cultural, technological, and um, developmental initiatives of Africa. The theme for this year's Africa's uh, titled Broadcasting Content, Synergy, Finance and Market is quite apt and suitable for a continent that is confronting the challenges of <coughs> adequate financing for content and markets. This edition will feature an area of intellectual presentation, illustrating discussions and expert roundtables, an integrated world-class expo, exhibiting the latest in broadcast technology, as well as a content hub, which is in collaboration with the Nigerian International Film and Television Summit, which will offer a wide range of interesting discourse on content creation, and aggregation, and financing. This assembly is a testament to our shared commitment to the ever-evolving world of broadcasting, where innovation, content, and technology con converge to shape our collective future. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure that I welcome you all to Africa's 2023, which begins today, Tuesday, the 24th of October, through to Thursday, the 26th of October, 2023. I'm delighted to have the privilege of declaring open a conference that is Africa's preeminent forum for broadcast content and technology and digital entertainment. Over several editions, Africa's has earned a reputation for the quality and depth that it offers in terms of thought leadership, knowledge sharing, agenda setting, networking, collaborations, and business and commercial opportunities. This conference has consistently attracted the who is who in the local and international broadcast industry, broadcast and media professionals, content platforms, production houses, equipment manufacturers, governments, and so on, from across the continent as has, and has helped to put Nigeria on the global broadcasting map once again. Africa's was conceived by the NBC, and you know that the NBC is, a, is an agency under the Prime Minister of Information and National Orientation. It was conceived as a response to and an enabler of the burgeoning potential of Africa's broadcast sector. The event has been envisioned to serve as a dynamic platform for broadcasters to showcase their content, exchange ideas, and explore strategic partnerships through a range of panel discussions, workshops, masterclasses, and content offerings. I'm told that this year's event will have a special session tagged Africa's 2023 Content Hub, which is the first of its kind in Nigeria. The hub, conceived in collaboration with Nigeria International Film and TV Summit, is a platform for the acquisition, aggregation, licensing, distribution of content by professionals operating across various film and television content categories. I welcome this innovative move, which is very much in alignment with the vision of Africa. For Africa 2023, we are welcoming you to Lagos and to Nigeria. All the thousands, perhaps hundreds of delegates and visitors representing close to 30 countries from around the globe. Welcome once again to Lagos, the commercial city of Africa. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, as we gather here today, we are reminded of the pivotal role that content creators, producers, and broadcasters play in shaping the entertainment industry in Nigeria and around the world. 
the entertainment industry has the power to inform, educate, entertain, and inspire, as well as drive positive change in our communities through the production and dissemination of high quality and compelling content. As we embark on this exciting journey for the next three days, I am confident that we'll live here with a new insights, connections, partnership that will all help us and will help shape the better future for our continent and for the world at large. Once again, I welcome all of you to Africa 2023. To all our delegates and visitors from outside Nigeria, I hope that you will find time to explore and enjoy the energetic ambience and rich hospitality of our beloved city by the lagoon. It now gives me pleasure, ladies and gentlemen, to formally declare Africa's 2023 open. I wish you all a productive and enjoyable time as we stay here. Thank you very much and welcome.